together. The band started uh, when Eamon and I met at school in Anaganesh a while ago. And uh, we started writing songs and didn't really have a band for a while. It was just the songs. And uh, then we had a Jordan a few years ago. And we started by recording our first EP with him. And then he joined on guitar and engineering that. And then Lockie moved to town for university about a year and a half ago. And uh, he joined, and then we have the solid lineup now. So, band. Yeah, yeah, the full band right now. After many failed attempts at trying a lineup, we finally got one we're comfortable with. Yeah. I guess Infana was written over like a four year span, probably. Um, as, as soon as we actually got out of uh, 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 X or whatever, we had started just writing music, pretty much. Um, and then it was just what was left. But well, we wanted to record a whole album with Jordan, I suppose, at the center when we did our first EP. And um, yeah, basically, we just didn't, like, just didn't have enough free recording time. So we did it all, uh, all ourselves. Everything else to this. 20 some songs or something like that that we just had. Yeah, around. basically. And we whittled it down to what became and fun. I just recorded it all in our basement. Yeah, yeah we, live, we live in a church rectory that we kind of have full run of. So we had all the time in the world to just set amps up in front of the bathroom and then mic the stairwell and get the reverb and do. We did all the shakers in the kitchen, I think, yeah. and just like the weirdest stuff we could think of. It was all done just in our house. And then, yeah, Jordan mixed it and put it all together. It's not wicked, honestly. That's pretty cool. Um, it was kind of like what we were doing at that time. Like when, when Eamon and I just started writing songs, it was like a representation of this kind of proggy jazz thing, but trying to fit in a lot of pop into it too. and just emulating the bands we liked and it was centered around a lot of like dual guitars and overdubs and things like that which we were doing a lot of that at the time and now it's kind of like we did Enfano and that's done and now we're kind of going in a different direction with the next one and everybody will be recording live off the floor kind of thing whereas Enfano was like pieced together almost like section by section because it was just like the two of us recording with joint engineering. Um, the next one will be live off the floor, everyone playing at the same time, minimal overdubs, no bullshit. Just kind of straightforward. And We're I'm going to be on it. And Lockie's yeah. going to be on it. Yeah, because I wasn't on it, Fauna. Because he was living this is in my, Ontario. I know. Yeah, this is my time to shine. Definitely like, uh, had to get them out of the way so we could start writing new songs. It's a real problem writing new songs when you have so many old songs that you just have like, not like, they're, just, they're there, they're not recorded, you can play them live, but you know, we really need to put them out there and then we can just kind of wash, well not wash our hands, but just step back a little bit, you know? Well, uh, right now we're kind of just doing a string of gigs up until probably the end of April, just to uh, kind of get the playing experience out of the way. We go into the studio in May uh, to record the new album and I think then we're going to take it easy for the summer just kind of hone the chops a little bit and uh, we might be touring with the Regal Beagle yeah band. maybe I'm not sure we might go to New Brunswick but it's mostly promotion in yeah the yeah and just kind of kick it off with a bang in September and get the new album out there and let people hear it we just As, at this point it's just uh, it's just really trying to to somebody, you know, the audience is out there, and we know that. Find them. Yeah, we just gotta yeah. find them. You, know. you can find us on Facebook, just search Floodland. And we'll Give me a favorite. Um, our website is www.floodland.com. We're on Twitter at Floodland Band. Bandcamp, we're on. So, we're just kind of all over social media I guess and where we could be. Yeah. We're playing the NSCC block party here with the Ten Heroes and Hate the Bit. So we're looking forward to that show. And yeah, we got a lot of gigs 
coming up still. And we've been gigging almost once a week for the past month or two. So we're looking forward to getting in the studio and getting some new stuff laid down.